Eight is on your side all week looking at the most dangerous things that are impacting our kids. Yeah, and we've gone from babies to high schoolers. Next up, college kids. They are off on their own, many for the first time ever. Amanda Shavari joins us live from outside the University of Tampa with a look at their unique challenges. Well, good morning. We all know that drinking can be a big part of the college party scene, but the most dangerous thing for college students is when that goes too far with drinking and drug use. A lot of students think that because their parents aren't there or because they have more freedom that this is the time to just celebrate. A time to celebrate with drugs and alcohol. According to the National Council on Alcoholism and Drug Defense, about four out of five college students drink alcohol. About half of college students who drink, binge drink. University of Tampa senior Anna Polo was one of those students. She tells me she never really drank before college. Her junior year is when things got out of control. And it's been hard because a lot of people my age did not understand that, that I had a problem because I was not using certain drugs or because I was not drinking early in the morning or the typical alcoholic stereotypes that there are. And for Polar, things really spiraled out of control. She has been assaulted, also attempted suicide, and fought for her sobriety. Coming up in the next half hour, she will share her complete story, hoping that it helps just one person in college who's struggling with the addiction things that she struggled with also. Marco? Yeah, unbelievable, and uh, a great example. If anybody can avoid that kind of a lifestyle, now's the time to talk to these students about that, Amanda. Thank you.